I'm going to show you how to install a font in Photoshop. Today I'm working on a James Bond poster, so I need a James Bond type font. Head on over to thefont.com, although other websites are available. Here you'll find lots of themes for you to browse. I'm going to click on one that I like. I think I'm going to click on sci-fi. Click. Then if you go to the preview window, you can type the name of the uh, text that you want to preview. I'm going to type the name of my Bond film, which is Silver Shot. Submit and scroll through the fonts that you take your fancy. Make sure in this instance, it's in keeping with the James Bond type font. And I really like the look of the first one. So click on download and save to your downloads folder. You'll see that it's downloaded top right. So click on the folder, double tap and click on the TTF file. When you double click on it, you will see the font preview. Click on install and it will be made available in Adobe Photoshop. So click on the text tool, click anywhere on your image Type the word of the film, so silver shot. It's going to come out very tiny and it's going to be in a black color, so highlight it and resize it. Now, I already installed the font uh, previously, but I'm going to show you how to select the name of the font. Click on the T tool, highlight the font, go to the top left and find the name of your font. In this instance, it was called Beyonder. Now, you can modify the font layer by double clicking in that gray space, double tap and you bring up these layer styles. You can go through each one of these settings by clicking on the left box. But if you click on the actual name, you've got some further options to modify. Keep modifying your look until you're happy with it. Remember, this is a non-destructive way of editing, so you can always go back by double-clicking on the layer style and modifying your design choices.